individuals fully talented managed to publish a Roblox game that would do incredible numbers. This game has soared to the top of the Roblox leaderboard and is set to receive numerous updates. This game is called Regret Evader and here you'll hear the success of Regret Evader. I didn't need them rice in my pockets, in my jeans I've been chillin' with my shorty, brand new 40, got a beam It all started when a Roblox developer named Y8UCC, formerly G8UCC, or just you, created his account on February 22nd, 2019. He began as just a regular Roblox player but recently got into scripting. He managed to get some developers and decided to revisit his oldest game and began transforming it into a new game called... Well, the name's in Chinese, so I'm not sure what it's called. The game did pretty well getting over 100,000 visits, but this game quickly fumbled losing all of its players. So he would completely abandon this game and work on more projects. He continued to make two new games, one named Glory, and the other game name is Chinese. One of these games currently sits at over 3 million place visits. He is still actively updating these games, but sometimes he takes breaks on them. He wanted to make something way bigger than the games he currently updates. He started a Roblox group called the Axolotl Sun, created in December 2019. Five hours after the group was created, Yu finally decided to create his first game on the group at 6.05 p.m. called The Sun Experiment. It was an early development. Basically, this game was a two-player demo. Basically, this game was a two-player demo puzzle game where you're in a facility solving puzzles and surprisingly, it also did well, just like his other games. There were also three games on the group he worked on, but those were now deleted and made to capitalize off of his most successful game. After this, he ended up taking a break from scripting and ended up coming back to it to make something way, way better than his old projects called Regret Evader. It was originally created in 2020, but the earliest known mention of Regret Evader was in the Axolotl Sun Discord server on October 16, 2021. When you shared a now deleted Twitter post about the game's early development, the first proper announcement came on October 25th when the game opened for an alpha public playlist. On November 24th, a teaser image of the lobby was posted in a Discord server, along with a release date set for May 12, 2022. Another now deleted post about the game accompanied this announcement. In the game, players can either explore the lobby to discover hidden secrets or enter the elevator to join a round. If a round is already in progress, players are taken to the spectating menu. Once the round ends, all spectators are automatically moved to the elevator. On certain floors, players can collect coins or purchase items, either from the shop menu or from special shop floors that offer unique items and effects not available elsewhere. Floors are key areas players explore in the game, chosen randomly after each intermission. Special floors appear after certain milestones, 20 or 50 floors. Players can select specific floors using floor tickets. These objects serve functional or decorative purposes and are either infinite or consumable, available in shops or exclusive floors. In game purchases offer benefits like cosmetics or gameplay advantages. In the game there are NPCs which are characters that players can interact with, some of which may enter the elevator or cause damage. The reason why Regret Evader was created is because the owner wanted to sit in an elevator and listen to Bossa Nova music due to the fact that he is autistic. Regret Evader will get continuous updates and added known characters such as Narpy, which they now changed his design. Are you serious right now, bro? Pest, Party New, and Spud, the other games that he has added to his group are test games about Regret Evader and let me break it down. April Ghoul's Regret Evader is a public duplicate of the main game, preserving the April Fool's update with a modified lobby, new models, the cows, and exclusive NPCs. The Sun Experiment is a two-player puzzle game where players navigate a facility, solving puzzles with the help of a TV guide. The main mechanic, Brevity slows the game and changes the environment to black and white. BLOCKAPOC is a comedic exploration game where players navigate islands by foot or vehicle using a shuffle tool to interact with NPCs like freaks, which are spawned via the Efreak Factory. Regret Evader has managed to gain over 89 million visits and has came a path towards success.